Hello gorgeous brides, it's Lindsay here from The Wedding Bell Shop. I've just got a really quick video for you today uh, about the different fabric options that we have for our veils because this is something that we get asked quite a lot actually. Um, I think because we've added quite a few more tools in the last couple of years, it used to be that there was only one, which was simpler times and definitely a lot easier for you, but there is actually a reason why we've added these extra ones. They give a little bit of a different look. So I'm just gonna quickly run through them all and see if it will help you identify which one might be for you. So if we start with this one then, this is our Bridal Illusion Tool. Um, back in the day, this is the only tool that you could choose and just in white or ivory, so definitely much simpler times. Um, it's hard for us, because it is the original one, not to still think of this as our main tool and everything that's come since then as kind of like a, a supplementary, you know, addition that just serves a specific purpose or, or gives you like a certain look. Um, so it's a really, really sheer, the most sheer actually, out of the ones I'm going to show you, Bridal Illusion, which is a type of tool made specifically for um, wedding veils. Um, it has a diamond weave to it, so little diamond shaped holes, and it's just so incredibly transparent, really delicate looking. Um, if you're worried about a veil covering any of the details on your dress and you want it to be as sheer as possible, this is definitely the, the one for you for that reason. And um, it's deceptively strong as well. We can put anything on this. It, it can take heavy laces, no problem at all. So this is kind of our favorite here to work on, to sew on. And if a bride just wants us to recommend a tool, if they just want the decision taken out of their hands, you just tell me which one, then we would recommend this one. And the light ivory is the, the most popular color that it comes in. So that's that one. So the second one that we added to our range is the shimmer tool, which is kind of like um, illusion that we've just gone through plus a shimmer effect. It's basically the same fabric, but it has shiny threads instead of matte threads. So it has those same big um, diamond shaped holes, making it quite nice and sheer. Um, I'm gonna hold them up together so you can kind of see a little bit of a, a side by side. There's not much in it, but this one is just a little bit less sheared because like I said, this one is the most sheer. Um, so yeah, if you fancy something with a little bit of a shimmer effect, um, maybe your dress has got shimmery sequins over the lace or something like that, then that could be a nice option for you. The next one that we've got for you is our silk effect tool. Um, so it's meant to sort of look quite a lot like real silk tool, but not at the same price point. Um, for a, a really good example of a silk tool veil that would be Princess Catherine's, so that really sort of heavily draping drop veil that she had. Um, it is a much heavier draping fabric as well. And because of that, what we've done on the website is these um, tools and this one that's coming up give a very similar light, airy look. And so what we tend to do is we photo graph everything on the website in the bridal illusion but if you choose the shimmer from the drop down or the italian from the drop down they're only going to look very very slightly differently obviously this one you'll be a bit shimmery um but this one if you were to choose this from the drop down menu what you'd receive just wouldn't look anything at all like what was in the picture so what we've done is made it so that to have this uh, fabric type you have to look for a veil on the website that's got the word silk effect in the title so if you just search silk effect on the um, in the little search box there a few will come up um, it is just because it is such a heavier draping fabric it doesn't have any volume to it as these ones do um, it drapes in a really sort of um, like a straight drop so say if you've got um, a really slinky dress that's figure hugging and then has a, a little bit of a puddle train. If you got a long veil in this, then this veil would kind of emulate that sort of look. It would be, you know, from the comb, really, really slim and slinky, and then it would just sort of collect in a nice little puddle train at the bottom, but without any height, no fluffiness, you know, it doesn't want to come around your arms and shoulders, it doesn't want to do anything but just sort of drop straight down, basically. So we do treat this one a little bit differently on the website. So just search for Silk Effect if you want to have a look at that one. But the rest of them, like I said, you can just find them in the drop down menu. And then the last one is the Italian style. This is the most recent edition, but it's becoming increasingly popular sort of day by day, really. I think what brides are loving about it is two things. One, that it's called Italian style, which sounds quite fancy. <laughs> and the second thing is that it feels really soft. So the difference between this one and our illusion 
um, just sort of using that as kind of our base tool example. You remember I said this one had quite nice big diamond holes in it? Well, the holes in this are much, much smaller, half the size, if not less. Um, and that what that results in is it feeling more like um, a chiffon or an organza fabric. You know, when you kind of run your fingers over it, you don't, you're not feeling the holes in it like you do on these ones. So it doesn't feel so much like a net. It feels more like a material fabric, if that kind of makes sense to you. Um, it is a little bit less see-through. Um, we'll do the kind of the little side by side so you can see. Um, but yeah, I, I think if, if it's up to me, I'm I'm always more about what it looks like. So I like them to be super, super sheer. Um, that's why that's my favorite. But if you are a very sort of tactile person that really likes things to feel dreamy and soft, then you might prefer the Italian style. Um, so that's kind of the four fabric types. And hopefully I've explained, you know, if you just want one that's kind of a traditional tool that is good for everything, go for the illusion. If you want a bit of shimmer, shimmer is for you. Really sort of slinky dress or wanting something that just sits in those kind of really elegant gather lines, go for the silk effect. And then if you just really like things to feel dreamy and buttery soft, then you've got the Italian style. I hope this video has been a little bit helpful. Um, I know there are a lot of decisions that you poor brides have to make. So if this has made this one just a teensy bit easier, then we've, we've done a good job today. Um, so thank you so much for watching this video and we will see you again.